rogue agents in the dark zones, hyenas, outcasts and true sons scattered across the districts of DC fighting over control and eliminating everyone in the way. Strongholds held by the Black Tusks who are set to take back DC. And not even the underground is safe. Wherever you set foot it's dangerous to go alone. Luckily you don't have to. In the base of operations you can create a clan of up to 50 agents to make sure you always have a group of agents to back you up. The clan system has several modifiers and has many benefits. We'll go over how to create and manage your clan, name a clan such as privacy, communicate with your clan, where the clan is located, how clan ranks work and finally how you can grow it. So uh, yeah, let's do that. Let's start with what a clan is in the world of the division. In the clan quarters you can create a clan unique to your own group, allowing you and up to 50 other agents to easily find and interact with like-minded agents. The clan is located in the east wing of the White House. Before being able to use the clan quarters, as it's called, you need to create a clan. Upon completion of a specific story mission, we don't know which one it is yet, you unlock the ability cr to create your clan. First you need to give it a name, up to 15 characters long, provide a 3 letter clan tag and create an insignia for it. This you can do already. On top of that you can write a short description or summary of the kind of clan it will be. Up next you can select your privacy where you have 3 options. Open, allowing anyone to search for and sign up for your clan. Invite only, allowing agents to join after an invite is sent by either the leader or other members. And private, allowing agents only to join through invites from the leadership. This is directly linked to ranks of which there will be four. The commander being the leader and creator of the clan granting him or her access to all admin functionality. The lieutenant, him or her being an officer of the clan with the ability to send out invites, promote and demote members and give access to the clan feed moderation. The clan leadership consisting of commander and lieutenants can inspect an applicant's characters and gear. The third one is the agent which is an established member of the community able to invite new recruits and the fourth and final one being the recruit, the rookie with no admin or clan functionality. Once part of the clan, in the clan quarters you can find multiple features, the first being the clan feed, allowing clan members to leave messages and give the leadership access to pin important messages and coordinate events. On top of that, a clan will have two voice channels, each with 25 players available in game for those who need it. It doesn't matter where the members are in the game, they can always communicate. The clan quarters also provides weekly projects, which deposit rewards in your clan stash. These projects and an upgradable clan cash reward members with three tiers of rewards, bronze, silver or gold. Each tier guarantees rewards, but silver and gold provides better ones than the one before. Besides that, members can also buy vanity items at the clan vendor, unique to that location, and these items will upgrade to higher quality as the clan progresses, even allowing cosmetic headgear with the clan's insignia on it. But how does a clan grow? Clan XP, or CXP for short, can level up your clan. Earning CXP gains member extra benefits for each level on your clan's journey to level 30, including additional customization options for your insignia. The CXP can be earned through weekly projects like we talked about and will reward you with a CXP boost. If you manage to complete all weekly objectives, you get a significant increase in the amount of CXP, resulting in a top tier clan. Exploring the capital and taking it back is awesome, but doing it with such a great supporting clan system makes it 10 times better. I will create a clan myself, the Masterminds HD clan, with subscribers, friends and other agents. If you're interested in that, join my Discord and I can sign you up for either the PC, PlayStation or Xbox One clan. So there's one of the 50 spots. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed or used this video, I would like to ask you to like or dislike, share, subscribe and click the notification bell to become part of the Masterminds HD community. On top of that, you can follow me on Twitter for daily updates and join my Discord if you're looking for an engaged community that revolves around Tom Clancy's Division 1 and 2. Both links are in the description. Visit my Patreon page through the link in the description if you're interested in intel briefs on stories, characters and weapon build guides with the summarized information from the corresponding videos. To end the video I have a question for you. Will you start your own clan or will you join one someone else made? Leave your answer in the comment section down below and I'll make sure to get back to you. I'll talk to you in the next video or Discord or on Twitter. Peace out.